specialist at Outback Power to discuss how to choose the right battery for your solar application. Jorge, with so many different energy storage options out there, how would you go about selecting the right one? Yeah, Danny, so it really comes down into how the battery is going to be used uh, in, in, in that particular application. Uh, in, in certain applications, the batteries are going to be sitting on standby uh, uh, on a float charge. So that battery will only be cycled or used per se uh, when the grid is down. Um, <clears throat> so, so then, you know, the, um, the battery will be able to handle that type of uh, um, uh, standby life. Uh, or if the, if the customer is going to be cycling that battery on a daily basis, then you want to make sure that that battery can handle those cycles on a daily basis. So I understand what type of application I'm looking mm -hmm. for. Can you tell me about what batteries fit within those? Yeah, for sure. Um, so there's three major players uh, in the market right now. Um, the first one would be the FLA or, or the flooded batteries. So these batteries have been around for decades, you know, and these have been the go-to battery um, for, uh, for solar uh, for a long time because they're robust, they're uh, easy to maintain, um, and their value uh, per cycle life uh, uh, equals out uh, uh, to be uh, uh, very uh, beneficial. Uh, the other one is the um, thin plate pure lead AGM battery, which is these guys right here. You know, this, this, these batteries have been the core technology for Energis for many years. Uh, and it's, uh, this battery has, has been proven to operate more efficient. Uh, it it, it, it uh, also gives uh, more life uh, and cycle life as well. Um, so, <clears throat> so again, um, AGM uh, VLA batteries um, uh, may, may, may offer the standby and the cycle life you know, for those two applications um, with no maintenance required. Uh, the third one would be the, uh, 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 the lithium battery, which is the new kid in town. Um, it's, uh, it's a newer technology, but it has been proven to operate very well with uh, solar plus storage uh, systems, um, you know, because they offer long life, um, they have a small footprint, um, and the only drawback is, you know, they have an up, uh, um, upfront cost. But um, again, you know, uh, those three batteries are probably good for um, most applications nowadays. Thank you. Outback has an energy storage offering for any application out there. If you want to learn more, visit us at www.outbackpower.com.